the biggest food festivals in all the land. Big time. Sure. Nice. Well, a new visitor center offers a chance to learn more about an important piece of Buffalo's history. Yeah, this will serve as the new headquarters for the Michigan Street African American Heritage Corridor. Local leaders cut the ribbon and opened the doors this morning. This visitor center will let people learn about African Americans' impact on the city of Good Neighbors and how that has spread all around the world. So today's official opening is only the first step in our, in our continued mission to transform our heritage corridor back into the thriving community uh, neighborhoods it once was. Yeah, this project's been a long time coming. Our Jordan Johnson looks at the ongoing effort to invest in this historic community. Making meals for her family led Deanna McQueen to start her own business here on Jefferson Avenue. Just like it's my passion, so it was like, one day I swept up on a, a location <laughs> and um, that's kind of how sugar these happen. Deanna says as a proud African-American woman, mother and caregiver, she wants to give back to her hometown. Well, I want to satisfy my people. I want to be big in Buffalo. I don't want to leave. I don't want to. I want to expand um, and I will expand, but it's Buffalo for me. Uh, I'm all about Buffalo. Deanna's home comes with a rich history, and much of that history is focused here at the Michigan Street Baptist Church. That's where I met up with Terry Alford, the executive director of the Michigan Street African American Heritage Corridor. Buffalo is truly blessed to have these cultural gems uh, nearly basically in their downtown core. Alford says all of these streets and buildings tell an important story about Buffalo's African American community, dating back to those seeking freedom in the 1800s. It really speaks to the 185 years of history uh, that really celebrates the cultural impact and uh, the significance made by African Americans in the city of Buffalo and its progressive growth. And it's that history that's inspiring people like Deanna to invest in its future. We're going to make it like everybody in the community is going to make it because it's like it's just all great people. Jordan Johnson, 7 News, Buffalo.